And out of the hijacking in the Red Sea, Yemen's Iran-backed rebels have seized a cargo ship over its connection to Israel, taking its crew hostage. Foreign correspondent James Longman has the story. Good morning, James. Yeah, good morning, George. Yemen's Houthi rebels say they've seized an Israeli-linked cargo ship in the Red Sea. The Iranian-backed groups say that any Israel-linked vessel is a legitimate target given the ongoing war in Gaza and what they call ugly crimes in the occupied West Bank. The United States has called this a flagrant breach of international law, uh, and the situation in the Red Sea remains uh, pretty serious. This is a ship which was uh, loaded with crew from Ukraine and Mexico, uh, not, however, uh, Israel. The Israelis say that there are no Israeli nationals on board. It is owned, uh, the parent company is owned by an Israeli businessman. Uh, and so the world is watching to see whether or not this situation uh, can be resolved. This is not the first aggression uh, by the Houthis, though they've fired a number of missiles and drones at southern Israel since the, uh, the attacks of October 7. Uh, and so now the world watches to see whether or not this, this ship can uh, be brought back to safety. Robin. All right, James, thank you so much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.